Hello, and welcome back to AIA and Interiors. Remember, if you like what you see here and you want to see more, hit that like button, leave any comments or questions that you may have, and don't forget to subscribe so that you can see more videos to come. In this video here, I will be demonstrating how to change the background color of our drawing window and then also our ribbon using AutoCAD 2020. Right now in front of you, you see that we have a, a white ribbon tab and then we also have a white color 2D drawing space. Starting with the upper ribbon of where you find all of your key elements, you will click on the large A and you will go over to where you have the options. Under options, you will see more ribbons to follow and you want to select that second ribbon where it will say display. Under display, where you have your window elements, you will see color theme. Currently, the color theme is set to light, which is why the background is in a white color. But if I was to go ahead and change this to dark, and then select apply, that upper ribbon window will change. And now it is in a darker hue of color. Staying in this exact same options box, you will scroll down to where it says color. Under colors is where you can change your 2D model space. Other things can be changed as well here. But for now, we're just talking about the color of this 2D model space. You can see in the preview, it shows you what your model space looks like and how objects will appear on that screen, whether it is in color, dark colors, light, or in between colors. If you go over to the color drop down, this is where you can select all of your background coloring. The preview box will show what your screen will look like and how images will appear on them as you click on the different color options. In most of the videos that you see here, I usually have the black color and this is what the black screen looks like. You also can manipulate it with other colors and make colors of your choice by going to the drop down and choosing to select your color tint. And once you decide on the color that you want, you will select OK, clear it in the preview, and then you will select Apply and Close. And notice how it changes on your screen. I personally enjoy having the darker screen for my eyes. A lot of times, others prefer to have the white screen. But once you have selected the color that you want, you will again select apply just to make sure that these selections stick and then select OK. And from here, you're all set and you now have changed your 2D drawing window color and also your top ribbon color as well. Again, I hope this video helped answer a lot of questions that I have been receiving about how to change the background colors of your 2D window and drawing space. Remember again to like and subscribe. Until next time.